Welcome back, Gene Nation. This is your host, Gene Buker Ace, a.k.a. Gene Rex, and this is Before They Was Famous Celebrity Commercials. Let's get it. Oh, I'm the 100th like. Let's go. Worldwide Internet Original. Let's see. Let's see if we spot anybody we know. What are you gonna do now? Well, thought about working. I'm retiring. Want a step you can real? Is he off of The Office or am I tripping? I don't know. I forgot where he's where he's from, but I know I remember his face though. Please skip. New cascade complete. Brad Pitt was in the Pringles commercial? I could see it. Yeah. But when you decide to step up to this kind of power, <laughs> Ant Man? This kind of challenge, this kind of flying crash. He was in a Zelda commercial. Go figure. Feeling. Unlike ordinary soap, she'll keep you smelling fresh and clean all day long. Hey, that's dude from Breaking Bad, a.k.a. Malcolm in the Middle's dad. You're a changed man. Shield works long after ordinary subscript. You expect the hemorrhoid medicine to relieve. You can, I guess you could say he was in a soap opera. In a soap commercial. You pain and itch, but you get an extra therapeutic action with Preparation H. Man, all I want to do is eat. Damn, not Preparation H. That's for your booty hole. What did you want me to say? Did you guys have an understanding? Uh-huh. <laughs> Gotta have my pop. Cause cheddar cheese makes all the difference. Hooray! I know. The best things come to those who wait. Oh, those golden grams taste like honey grams. It's a delicious honey gram taste. Give me that crunchy. Give me that crunchy. Give me that come up taste. And it is Keanu Reeves. Bro, this man was mad young. We can barely recognize him. I want the best in my bowl. I want Kellogg's Corn Flakes. I'm proud of you. Really proud. A Coke. The biggest taste in Kellogg's Corn Flakes. Grace, who's your coach? My dad. You've got time for Kellogg's Pop-Tarts. Joseph Gordon-Levitt. Ain't that the dude from um, Inception? Am I tripping? He was in the Batman series. That's my boy. That is him. Damn. Oh, I can still see it. He still has that look. Like he's obviously he's older now, but because he never grew facial hair, I can see it. Hey Ralph, check out this dream I had. Yeah. What the him. hell? Hey Ralph, check out this. That dream. was Seth Green. Damn, that does not look like Seth Green. Dream I had. Yeah. I get up. I wash my face, and I notice I got a lot more face. I'm the guy on the Kellogg's Fruit Loops box. I'm Toucan Sam. What do you think, Ralph? Jack Black. Oh my God, that's Jack Black. I have never seen, I don't mean nobody shaming when I say this, because you know you guys say stuff like that now. But I have never seen this man slim. Like, bro, he's always been the big guy, bro. And I love that about him, bro. He was, a, he was an amazing character, actor, performer, all that. I love his work over the years. I mean, from Schoolhouse of Rock to his performances and hosting um, the Nickelodeon um, Choice Awards all these years since I was a kid. But the fact to see him as a kid, like, nigga, seeing Jack Black as a kid is like seeing Morgan Freeman as a baby. It's something that you would never thought you would see. And he looks so slim. What the fuck? Yo. Let's just take a look at this man. Oh, kid. The kid Jack Black. Last night, I was lost in the jungle with Pitfall Harry. Surrounded by giant scorpions and man-eating crocodiles. Big news from Brown's Chicken. Surrounded by... He was, he was born for Jumanji. <laughs> That sound like he got the hat since he was a kid. Wow. Giant scorpions and man-eating crocodiles. Big news from Brown's Chicken. What we 
That looks like Steve Carell. Mm -hmm. We've always cooked our chicken in cholesterol-free cottonseed oil. We now have cholesterol-free batter, too. So our chicken is cooked completely cholesterol-free. Because we put you first at locations all over Nebraska. You're first here at First Tier. Did you see the current interest rate at Mutual Savings Bank? It's Cena Fay from SNL, I think. Yeah. Really high. Luckily, I know perfect way to show McDonald's how I see. Damn, she looks like a well, she is a baby, but wow, yeah. damn. I go to Burger King. Burger King and Pepsi, two winning tastes. Together at last. Together at last. <laughs> Andrew McCarthy. I think I know who that is. I think. Together at last. Together at last. Elizabeth Shue. Is that old girl? She looks like old girl from um, Karate Kid. <laughs> oh, hey, man. <sighs> Together at last. Together at last. <laughs> is that never gonna give you up? Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna turn you around. Desire to. That's what it looks like. I don't know who the hell. Matter of fact, that's not him. That's um, he plays in um Grandma's Boy, and I think he was in uh. That's the only movie I know him from. Honestly, uh, I don't think I remember him in anything else. But damn, he looks like the dude from Never Gonna Give. You look like Rick Rolled in this commercial. Oh hey man, what do you mean Box has bite? Here, try some of this. He was much slimmer back then, but I can still tell in his face that that's him. That's the OG Knicks. Dad? Because at Burger King, when you- Fucking Ben Affleck, bro? Damn. Dad's been acting since that long, bro? I can see it. I can see it in his face. Like, when he lets his face rest, I can see it. But when he, like, moves his face around and exaggerates and do different facial expressions, it's hard to pinpoint that that's him, but- off of this resting facial expression, that's definitely him being Affleck. Wow, damn, I didn't know he was acting that long. Because at Burger King, when you want to give people what they want, sometimes, be right home, you've got to break the rules. Michael J. Fox. Damn, this man been acting since he was a kid. I thought he started as a teenager. If you don't know Michael J. Fox, it's Back to the Future, one of his biggest movies. Uh, he did a lot of other shit, but that's that's something that everybody should know. Like Teen Wolf, came. 80s version. That doesn't even look like him. Like what the fuck? Angie Harmon? I don't know who the hell that is. I knew you'd get it. it. Must be from heaven. No, no, no. If you get it, get it. Nothing, nothing like it is. Megan Paul. Now there's nothing like the price. She looks familiar. Hold it. I just have to tell you about the Aren't You Hungry for a Whopper game at Burger King. Could be the best taste of tomato hamburger. I remember him, Jason Alexander. I remember his face. I didn't know that was his name. I forgot what I saw him in, but yeah, I remember him. Britney Spears? I'm getting dead, bro. She was in a sauce commercial, a barbecue sauce commercial. I guess you could say she had the sauce. Morgan Freeman. That's real gun right there. That's smooth. We marched a long way. Stay. Out of all commercials, you had to be in the black and mild commercial. I'm like, <laughs> black and long cigarettes. Damn it, Morgan. That's real gun right there. That's smooth. That don't even look like him. What the fuck? I mean, maybe from off the freckles. That's the only way I was like, Low key, see, but like, nah, bro, he looks hella young. What the hell? We this is about as young as we about to get from Morgan. You ain't never seen no baby Morgan picture. If you've seen it, it's not the real thing. It's probably Photoshop, unless he posted it on his Instagram. I don't think that Morgan freaking has an Instagram. Unless did he post? Unless he's shown it on an interview. <laughs> You're not seeing the young Morgan Freeman, bro. The youngest Morgan Freeman I've seen was just now. Literally just now in this commercial. What the hell? March the long way. Stay black. Stay strong. Stay black and long. We made 
like this video. Hope it's cool. Hope you like it. Hope you think it's good. Yeah, that's right, bro. Wow, that's wild. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Do y'all remember any of these commercials? Have y'all seen any of these commercials? Did any of the celebrities look familiar to you? I, I was able to spot a few. Some I didn't know, but most I did, you know? It was 50-50. I knew about at least five out of 10, you know? But for the most part, the one that I think surprised me the most was the Jack Black one. The Jack Black one, the Morgan Freeman one, the Britney Spears one, I thought she started her debut with the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. I, I guess not. Um, who else was a shocker? Mm, Keanu Reeves. That's about it. Everybody else, okay. I said, uh, Ben Affleck, the Ben Affleck one threw me off. I didn't know he was acting that damn long. I'm like, damn, am I, my guy? It was a lot. It was a lot. It was a lot. There's a lot of them. But those are like the standout ones to me. Like, Jack Black has number one pick off for this list, though. Like, I did not expect to see a slim Jack Black and a kid Jack Black at that. I didn't know he'd been acting that long. Like, damn, son. Where'd you find this? I be trying to figure out where they be finding these commercials, bro. Like, who is y'all? Who is y'all resource? Who is y'all plug for this? Nard War, the the human um uh, servant. Hey, but I appreciate each and every one of y'all for tuning in for today's video. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notifications, and I will see you guys in the next video. If y'all have any suggestions for any commercials you would like to, for me to see, like Super Bowl commercials from overtime stuff like that, let me know in the comment section down below. Uh, it don't matter what cultural commercials. It could be Mexico, Canada, any, whatever, African culture. I might just tap into a different commercials from different cultures. Um, I already did Japanese, American 90s, early 2000s for me. Uh, and, you know, just now with the famous celebrities one. So let's see what else we could tap into. Uh, without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next video. Road to 1,000 subscribers, like, comment, subscribe. Peace. GMB out.